Hey, Chiefs Kingdom, welcome back to KC Sports Report. I'm your host, Michael Darcy, your go-to source for daily Kansas City Chiefs coverage. Today, we're diving into some major roster moves the Chiefs have made ahead of their showdown with the Raiders this Black Friday. If you enjoy our content, please hit that like button and subscribe for more updates. The Kansas City Chiefs have been incredibly busy this Tuesday making several roster changes that will impact the team as they prepare to face the Raiders. Let's break down what's happening. We just got a significant update from Matt Derrick, a beat writer for Chiefs Digest, who shared the complete transaction list. Here's what the Chiefs have done. Kicker Matthew Wright has signed to the practice squad, and tight end Baylor Cup has been restored to the practice squad from injured reserve. In addition, tight end Peyton Hendershot has been placed on injured reserve. Defensive end Cameron Thomas has been waived. And offensive tackle Lucas Nyang and defensive end Truman Jones have also been released. It's clear that the Chiefs are making some tough decisions. For those of you who thought I was crazy when I said this morning that Spencer Shire was going to be out against the Raiders, it looks like I was onto something. Reports indicate that Spencer did not practice today due to a hamstring injury and it sounds like Matthew Wright is ready to step in as the new kicker. He's even got a locker at the Chiefs' facility now, so it seems almost certain he'll be playing this weekend. Hendershit going on IR isn't a major shock, given the reports we saw earlier today. It's unfortunate for the depth at the tight end position, but it's part of the game. Now, the release of Cameron Thomas is a bit surprising. The Chiefs traded for him earlier, though it wasn't a high draft pick. Clearly, the team has had enough time to evaluate him in a Chiefs uniform and decided to move on. Luke